Hey there, how's it going? Well, I had originally lined up a video. I, I had made a whole video, edited it in the whole, edited it, edited it, did did it, did it, did it, edited it, edited it, and the whole works. And I decided not to release it because I think it would be punching down. And what it's in reference to is this notion that if someone has the wrong kind of mindset, if they have a mindset that people who are in Antifa and those that think similarly deem as fascist or Nazi or as white supremacist or as white nationalist, that anyone who has that kind of mindset, who's deemed to have that kind of mindset, shouldn't have any rights. And that just kind of, that just... That just blows my mind that there are people that push this notion. I mean, since since the late 80s, but I, I'd say I saw it more often since like the mid-90s on uh, discussion forums, political discussion forums. I've seen this, this phrase where people say, closed minds should come with closed mouths. And I'm like, how do... So you don't believe in freedom of speech at all. People who push that notion don't believe in freedom of speech. Just flat out. And and some of but but some of this shit I've been seeing, I, I was seeing on Twitter and this one guy's video that I had made a response to that I decided not to release is saying that you know, people shouldn't even have the right to vote if they hold those opinions. If they're deemed to have a white nationalist, white supremacist, KKK, fascist, or anything remotely close to that, if they're deemed to have that kind of opinion, that they shouldn't have rights. Don't have a right to a bank account. Don't have a right to vote. Not even really that they have the right to work and make money. And I just... So we, we should just, if you have the wrong opinion, you should live on the street? Is that it? I, I just can't wrap my mind around it. I really can't. How can you say that you love what this country stands for and spew that kind of crap? I mean, you have the right to spew it. I don't think your rights should be taken away because you spewed that. But I can't understand how someone can think that they love this country and turn around and say some shit like that. They certainly don't like the First Amendment. Anyway.